How does chapter 13 work? Chapter 13 is the most powerful and most misunderstood debt relief option. Chapter 13 is a payment plan, but it might pay back nothing to most of your creditors. Chapter 13 is more powerful than Chapter 7 in many ways, but Chapter 13 is not well understood by many attorneys, and so it's underutilized by too many consumers. Chapter 13 allows you to do things that aren't even possible in a Chapter 7. You can lower your car interest rate. You can even pay less than you owe for cars that you keep. And you can catch up on missed payments for your car and your home and make creditors accept late payments, which they can refuse to do in a Chapter 7. And many people have credit union debt. If you owe secured and unsecured debts, think of a car and a credit card, to a credit union, Chapter 13 breaks this cross-collateralization so that you can keep your car but not pay the credit card. Credit unions want you to reaffirm both the card and the car if you want to keep the car in a Chapter 7, but you don't have to do that in a Chapter 13. So what does a Chapter 13 do? Chapter 13 allows you to restructure your debt into a three to five year payment plan. Some plans must be five years, others can go from three to five years. You can keep your current vehicle and possibly pay less for it than you would pay if you had reaffirmed it in a Chapter 7. And at the end of the plan, your car payment is gone, all your other debts are wiped out with a few exceptions that apply also in Chapter 7. In Chapter 13, the amount that you pay to your creditors depends on a number of factors, but my Chapter 13 plans typically only pay about 1% to the unsecured creditors, which is about like a Chapter 7 that pays zero. How does Chapter 13 work? Chapter 13 payment plans are administered by a trustee, but the trustee doesn't monitor your bank account or look over your shoulder. Your payments to the trustee can be made by payroll deduction, but I often ask for and usually get a bank account withdrawal approved so that your employer doesn't need to get involved. Plan payments normally don't increase during the life of your plan, but it's possible if your income experiences a significant increase, but that's the problem that you like to have. Life during Chapter 13. Most of the time, your Chapter 13 has absolutely no impact on your normal life's activities. You can go on vacation, change jobs, move to another state. You can get credit cards, even buy a house while you're in an active Chapter 13 case. There are very few restrictions. Life is less stressful in Chapter 13. Your creditors can't call you, sue you, or even send you a bill. And because every case has the family budget allocation, protected before money is paid to creditors, many people actually have more money in their monthly living expense allowance than before they file. Money that used to go to pay the unsecured debt is now freed up to pay for the family's needs. Is Chapter 13 worth it? It's a question that many people ask. They've heard stories about how hard it is to be successful in a Chapter 13. And the truth is that some people do find it challenging, but many of my clients tell me it's a big relief to be in a Chapter 13 plan. I've been filing Chapter 13 cases since 1986 and have one of the highest success rates in the entire country. I believe that people who struggle for cha with Chapter 13 do so for two main reasons. First, people in Chapter 13 often need support from their attorney. The attorney's guidance and advice can keep a case on track and provide valuable direction, and answers to clients who need them. We're the biggest bankruptcy firm in Southern Ohio and we have a very large staff. This helps our clients stay on track and get the help and advice they sometimes need during their Chapter 13 plan. Second, we all know that sometimes life throws us unexpected challenges and this is not any different for people in Chapter 13. And when you're in a Chapter 13, you don't have the option to go out and borrow large sums of money, so sometimes this is a problem. But it would also be a problem for someone not in Chapter 13. So is, is Chapter 13 worth it? The overwhelming majority of my successful Chapter 13 clients would answer with an enthusiastic yes. They keep their homes, their cars, sometimes saving them from loss through foreclosure or repossession. They rebuild their credit with my built-in credit recovery program, often getting better credit than they had before they started their Chapter 13. Is Chapter 13 right for you? Find out for free. In one phone call, you can learn more about how Chapter 13 can help you than spending hours surfing the net. Chapter 13 has a lot to offer. Find out if it's right for you.